how are you guys doing today? Yes, today is going to be Friday. Happy Friday. How are you doing today? How are you doing, guys? I hope everybody's doing good. I want to say, well, first of all, welcome to the video. If this is your first time, my name is Leslie. If this is your second time, third time, girl, you know we friends. I know you done subscribed. How y'all doing? So this morning, it's a little chilly here. That's why I got, and I was out running errands this morning. So that's why I'm all cozy looking this morning. Um, And I got me some coffee. I got me some coffee because y'all, I was up last night. Mm -hmm. I was on social media. It's something I don't normally do. But I was up kind of late. You're getting this on Friday, but this is actually election day. This is the day that we found out who our new president was. I was up on social media, texting with other people, talking with other people, and child was up half the night. So your girl needed her a second cup of coffee for this week. So I hope you guys are doing good. Um, I wanted to start out first off by saying uh, you will have gotten a Wednesday video, but there was no shout outs. I had a little message for the end of Wednesday's videos that did not get added to the clip. The video was one minute and it only said that I believe that I've gotten all the shout outs out that I had. I was supposed to do two a week, but I wanted to go ahead and get those people out because they had given me their information a while ago. So, but I was only supposed to do two a week, but I ended up putting everybody together because I wanted to give everybody in front of, you know, the audience. So I also said that if I missed you, if you got missed, cause I get a lot of emails and that's why I tell people don't send me emails that I don't ask for. Like if you're not sending me any emails that you want to, you know, tell the community about something or if you are uh, giving me like something to help the community or if I didn't ask you, let's say you are a psychiatrist and you say, girl, I want to contribute to the community. I'll say email me. So. I still get emails anyway, because people still want to send you emails and give you a long history of everything they've gone through on their job. So some, I said all that to say, you may want to send me your information again if I missed you, but I believe I got everybody. But in case I didn't get you, sis or bro, send me that information again because i think i got everybody but i got a feeling somebody may have got lost i don't get the went through all of emails and i said look like i got everybody but if i didn't please send me this is for the shout outs send me a screenshot of your youtube if you are 50 and plus and you are under a thousand subscribers and you want to shout out this is your first time send me an email with your youtube information okay Again, I said the only requirement is to be subscribed and I will get you shouted out. Um, I think I got everybody, but just in case I didn't, I wanted to say that because I don't want nobody to feel left behind. We ain't trying to leave nobody behind. Well, how y'all doing this morning? I hope everybody's okay. I hope everybody's doing good. Y'all, we got this. We got this. We do. If you know who your father is, you know that he got this. No matter who is in presidency, I don't care, y'all. It don't matter. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We all vote for whoever we want to vote for. But do know that God reigns. Mm-hmm. And if he is your God, then you know you don't govern yourself by the world's standards anyway. So if you don't govern yourself by the world's standards, you're not so bummed out this morning. Well, it wouldn't be your morning, but you know what I mean? You wouldn't be. You wouldn't be because you would know that I'm not governed by that system anyway, so it don't even matter. Okay? Y'all know what I'm talking about? Mm. My sisters and brothers know what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. We ain't governed by this world, so it don't even matter, baby. Mm -hmm. It don't matter. We blessed and highly favored by our Father, which is in heaven. Mm -hmm. We have to live in this world, but we're not of this world. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So if you came here for a message, there you go. You in this world, but you're not of this world. Don't forget it. Mm -hmm. Don't forget it. Mm -hmm. Don't let nothing get you all riled up because somebody done won something. They won that, but they ain't won the kingdom of God. Girl, boy, you got this. You got this. Snap out of it. Good morning. 
How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> okay, we got this. Yes, we do. So guys, I have a lot of good content coming out and y'all been supporting your girl. Yes, y'all really like that video of, um, what did I title it? They're going to fire me. Y'all done hit that one good. I believe it said 2K. And that's good for one of my daily videos that I daily put out. Because it's weird how some topics go viral and some sit there with 500. It looks like the average of my watch is like 500 people. Which I get a little confused because I have 21,000. I'm not understanding why only five watches, 500 watches a video. You would think I'd at least average 10% and at least get 2K a video. That's what you would think, you know. So a lot of people came to look, they subscribe, but they ain't been watching them videos. Now, I do notice that some of y'all be coming out of the trinkets when it depends on the title. This is why I spend a lot of time with thinking of titles. Because it's like, girl, you could have a message up in here and, and title it wrong and nobody watch it. Because to be honest with y'all, y'all, I put a lot in all my videos. I really do. It was only one day that I know that I was like, what am I doing? Was that morning that I came back from having two days off? I was like going in circles. And I felt, you know how it is when you go back to your job and you ain't been there. You had a three-day weekend, baby. You be like, what am I in here doing? I don't, <laughs> what is my password? Get in there, you can keep putting the wrong password. That's the way I was that day. I was like... Oh, I see. When you stay away from the camera for a few days, it wasn't that I was lost. I was a little, because every day I be doing these. So I come in here and it's like a continuum the next day. But when I took two days off, it was like, what am I doing? Wait a minute, what am I talking about? <laughs> it was. So for the most part, my content is pretty good. Now, I do feel like when I first started doing these these morning motivations, now I put them uh, morning chats. And then I'm putting like a little dash and giving you some type of understanding of what it's going to be about so you can know. That was a good suggestion of one of my one of the guys said. How about you? He said, "Good a suggestion. Can you put a little bit about what the, the video gonna be by just you know?" And I was like, "That's that makes sense." So that's what I did was I put just a little bit about now what they gonna be about. So today, since we just chitty chatting like we talking now, ain't no telling what I'm gonna put the title for. But I'm probably saying y'all all right, everything okay? We got this, y'all. We are the kingdom of God. So I just came in this morning to just encourage it about everybody to keep their head up. Because y'all know we ain't governed by this world. We don't matter. Honey, no matter who won that, it don't matter. It really don't. Because you walk by faith. So if you walk by faith, I don't care if the devil gets prayed. It don't matter. I ain't said it to somebody else. I said, honey, Fred Finstone, uh, I don't care, Freddy Krueger could have won. If you are governed by God, all this stuff don't matter to you. See, mm -hmm, it don't. If you know what that Bible says about you, you don't let nothing bother you. Ain't, this stuff do affect the world, but it won't affect you if you keeping your mind and yourself straight and right with God. Because you can be in the world, but not of the world. Let me stop. I won't get deep, but, you know, I, I'm just trying to put it plain and simple for y'all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. we, we're not governed by this world standards. No, we're not. So y'all know what? Your girl came back from her um, run of errands, and I forgot my hat. Because y'all know I got my hat below the whistle and my whistle. I, when I was in the camera looking, I said, girl, you didn't put your hat on. You forgot your whistle. It's because I went out this morning and I ran an errand. And when I got back, I said, oh, you got to do your morning motivation. Because I was about to go um, edit. Because I got two videos to edit. But I said, no, do your morning motivation before you edit. That way you can do that motivation. You can edit while you're doing, you know, you can edit that one as well. So I thought I would come on here and I was going to do a video while I was running my errand. I said, let me, but I already got some good videos coming up. So I said, Leslie, you, you good girl. Everybody. All right. I said, everybody going to be fine. And I did put a message in the chat that I took out, you know, just asking everybody how they was doing. But I said, just do a whole video and just ask everybody. Y'all all right. Mm -hmm. 
Y'all, we got this. Don't worry about nothing. Don't don't worry about a thing. Mm -hmm. You got this. So, carrying on to our work stuff, we gonna have some really good videos coming out. And I've been asking y'all, if you have a topic you want me to go over, that y'all know in the community tab, go in there. I got a designated post for any topic. So, the next time I do a live, I'm gonna go through all of them topics like I did the last live. If you miss Sunday live, you missed it, girl. You missed it. You better go watch Sunday Live. Sunday Life was good. That live stream was good, y'all. After I did that live stream and I had finished up all my stuff for the day because I had had a Zoom that day. I had had a live stream. I had done uh, uploaded three videos and I um, edited three. I had a busy day. And after I finished that day, because I know we don't work on Sundays. We, you know, I don't work on Sundays. Now, when I was doing it overtime, I was working on Sundays. I ain't even lie. But what, now I'm doing this, I know we don't work on a Sunday. So I said, Lord, I didn't get service. So we're going to have to get service. Because I was going all day. I didn't get service. and I, But I felt so uh, aligned. I felt like, Leslie, you in God's will. You know when you in God's will, that's the best place and the best, that's the best place to be is in God's will. And that's what I was telling y'all about these job situations. Sometimes you just might be in the belly of the well, Jonah, because you on the wrong assignment. Maybe, sis, maybe, bro, you might just need to get away from where you at. But you know, I know y'all got to make plans. Somebody say, can you make an exit plan? I'm going to be honest, and I'm going to tell you this. I told y'all on my last video, all this stuff is free 99. Ain't none of it costing a dime. But if you, I think a whole complete exit plan, which I'm working on, but I'm working on that with God, that one will probably be in a form of a PDF or something for you to purchase, a whole exit plan. Because that's got to be something thought out, something that I have to take months or weeks to do. I don't want to throw something at you quick for you to buy so you to come back and say, what the heck did you sell us? I feel like I'm working on an exit plan for people. And when an exit plan ain't easy. So if anybody give you anything within a day or two, that's something they just sit up and thought of and they did not ponder on that. So I'm not going to come up with something real fast to sell y'all nothing because like I told y'all, what I done went through, you can't put a price on it. You can't put a price on what I done dealt with. I am not nobody that just on here trying to tell you something to sell you something, baby. This stuff I'm telling you is priceless. Yeah. So I would like to put an exit plan together and with a charge on it because I'm not going to come with I've already thought about it. I said, Leslie, we're not going to throw nothing at these people real quick to make no money. We're not going to prostitute what God gave you. I'm not going to do it. So, I want to put an exit plan together for y'all. But, it's going to take some time. So, you're not going to get it this week. You're not going to get it next week. You're not going to get it next month. God going to have to give it to me. When he downloaded it to me, I'm going to know that it came from him. And I could go do a lot. I will do research as well. But I want him to, when he downloads stuff to me, I know he came from him. So I'm going to give you an exit plan. I'm going to give it to you in some form of a, a, a downloadable something. I don't know. But just not right now. Just hold on. I'm going to get that for you. In the meanwhile, we, I'm going to be giving you tips and tricks and all that. Mm-hmm. I, and I know y'all probably said, well, girl, I thought you said you wasn't going to be on her ceiling, nothing true. But I had thought about an exit plan and I feel like I'm giving you good free information. But when it comes to me, if I'm going to take out probably time that I probably should be sleeping and resting and on my leisure time to do something, then I feel like that's when you charge. But every day that I feel like I'm getting up here, giving y'all a word or, or, or talking about what I done dealt with on the job, just doing stuff like that. I feel like that should be free. Cause God, won't, he don't, I don't feel like I need to be charging for nothing like that. But I feel like to give you a street, a strategic plan of exit, which I'm kind of already doing that anyway in some of these videos, y'all. I done told y'all 
but I've, will you get that video before you get this one? Because I don't want to talk too fast. Yes, you will get that video. I'm telling you what to do with your short-term disability and all that. Get you a little rest. So I'm giving you nuggets and pieces. But I feel like there is a complete plan to this. But I don't want to do it simple. I don't want to give it to you in a weekend. That ain't God. If I give it to you in a weekend, if I give it to you in a month, I don't feel like that's God. It's going to take some time. Mm -hmm. And I know something else to be happening on these uh, videos too. Some people be trying to go and steal my stuff. When I say stuff, I done seen the sisses. I'll say something and some people will comment and they trying to get my followers to go to their page and then they do like a reaction almost to what I done said. Don't y'all be stealing people's stuff. I know I be talking, but I don't care what you do. You can't steal what God give me. Mm-hmm. You can't do it. Because some, some ladies over here think they slick. They be over here talking about, mm, girl, I got a channel. And I talked about that yesterday. And they do somewhat of, um, I went on one of them ladies' pages and they said, don't quit your job. I don't care what nobody telling you. But they were on my page saying, mm-hmm, people need to quit these. I was like, y'all, don't be doing stuff like that. I don't, I mean, everybody is entitled to their opinion and their page and what they want to do. But... I don't go on nobody's page to see what they saying and doing for me to make content. The content, this is why I'm telling you can't nobody steal what God download to me. Because I don't go finding other people's stuff to do a reaction to what they say. To be like, uh, because I never told y'all to quit your jobs anyway. I told you I did mine. But some people would, would say, don't you quit your job. Don't you listen to YouTube. Don't you do. Girl, make, see this is how you gonna keep followers you may get them you may get subscribers but you're gonna keep people by being authentic by you giving people what you authentically have not what you went and read and and watch somebody else video so you could do a reaction to them because you don't think that they said the right thing or they doing the right thing or or this that and the other i see so many of that y'all doing that to that poor lady doordash everything that woman do somebody out here with a reaction or adding her I, at her name, baby, be yourself. Because we can tell copycats, be an original. So I don't care how you react to what I'm saying or get in my comments and, and be talking like you on my side and you go on your page and you got a whole nother thing going. Girl, mm -hmm. I ain't worried about it. You know why? Because like I said, what he downloaded to me is only to me. Mm -hmm. I ain't worried about it. Y'all be nice, cause I want everybody to grow. I want, and I know somebody probably say, "Girl, uh, a thing ain't just for you." It, you know, YouTube, you can spin things around, and you can do that. That's true. But if I say that, okay, let let's take me for example. I'm on here saying, "Y'all, I'm blowing the whistle on these companies. I don't trust them. I, I'm for my people." And then I go on your page and I say, "Girl, I'm on your page, and you probably." For the employer. And I'm on your page saying, girl, yeah, I'm for the employer. Ain't that two-faced? Or do that not make no sense? You see what I'm saying? That's what I'm talking about. That right there. That right there is what I'm talking about. Because mm -hmm. that means that you got people, and I already know it. I got 21,500 watch one video. So that mean that they watching and they really not for you. Mm -hmm. You got a good majority is, but you got some people just watching. Or some people, what I don't realize is a lot of y'all doing, and let me tell you, I, I say it a little bit, but let me tell you again. What, 18, 19 minutes? Let me tell you again. You don't have to go react to everybody's stuff for you to blow up. Let me tell you what you got to do. You got to get in line and you got to get out there and put, the more you put content, the more you're going to get used to being on this camera. And once you get used to being on the camera, your real self will flow. And you don't, people going to see that. And they're going to be like, oh, I like her. She real. Because you're going to get, you, you, the more you do videos, the more you, you get used to it. I was just critiquing my friend the other day on a video that she just recently made. I say, girl. You now coming into what you're supposed to come. She said, girl, I got like a hundred some subscribers now. I say, yes, you know why? Because you sound more like yourself now. You don't sound like you making something up. I told y'all, I don't come with no script. Mm -mm. You sounded more like yourself now. You're not sounding fake. Or you're not sounding like, oh, y'all, how y'all doing tomorrow morning? Great, and you know that 
ain't your personality, really. You know you like, girl, whatever. Hmm. What what I be saying all the time? Hmm. I got something I be saying. See, that's me. And that's what y'all come to see. So you don't have to add people and you don't have to copycat people and you don't even have to be over here lying like you with me and you really not for me and then making reactions to what I do. All you got to do is be yourself, sis. That's what people coming to see. They coming to see you as the real person. So uh, some meals that y'all, and, and, and this is motivation because people need to stop doing it. So if you say, girl, I thought this was a mode, I, I done stopped putting motivation. This is chat. Mm-hmm. Something else. There you go. Mm -hmm. See, that's me. Uh, something else is some of these people that be going and doing videos. They ain't doing videos. They doing lives. I done caught a couple, three, four, five people doing lives against this one young lady. And I'm like, what is wrong with us, Jesus? You know what it is? People don't think that that what it is, is, is low self-esteem. And you think that if you talk about me, you're going to get subscribers. But they're so stupid. Let me tell you how to get subscribers. If you knew, and you probably don't even want subscribers. You may just be over for the, the uh, motivation. But let me talk to the people that want some subscribers. And want, and they don't have to be YouTube. It can be Instagram. It can be Twitter. It can be uh, TikTok. It can be whatever you want. This, this applies for all. Let me tell you something that you don't have to do. You don't have to tear me down to get subscribers. This is what's wrong with the African American community. Y'all figure y'all figure out how to put me on a, a, a do a reaction to this because this is something that my black sisters and brothers need to know. Stop sitting on lives. I don't call two to three people sitting and doing a live by one young lady. And I'm like, I got on it to see what were they talking about. I was like, what What could you be talking about 24? They got 24-hour live. And I'm like, to turn down one person? I'm like, what the hell is wrong with her? Oh, can I say that on YouTube? Okay, we probably going to get that out. But what is wrong with us? And, and I said and I asked God about it because it was happening like almost a whole week. They've been on here doing a live about this one young lady. And we all African American, and I'm trying to figure out why we why we why are we trying to get why are you doing each other like that? So I I started kind of asking God about some of the stuff to be going on, and I realized if you think you need to do somebody like that, you don't believe in yourself. Because mm -hmm. like I said, if you stop copycatting, coming over here see what I'm saying to make a reaction to 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 let people know she ain't saying what's right, I'm saying what's right. Why would you need to do that? Why not just be original and say, you know what? This is how I feel about my situation or this or that and the other. Why do we need to pull each other down? We think to get up. Let me tell you, you don't have to do that because what God got for you, can nobody take from you. So you don't need to tear another one down. You don't need to do that. You don't need to do it. Because on the flip side, while you think you turn this woman's name up, her subscriber account keep going up. So the trick's really on you. Because God is not in that mess y'all be doing to each other. That's why I'm over here, y'all. To try, I ain't did it real hard because I'm I gotta ease my way into you black folks like me. Mm-hmm. If I go too hard. You ain't going to want to listen to me. I'm going to ease some stuff in on us. Cut that out. Mm -hmm. Cut that out. Why y'all going to sit on a freaking 24-hour live to tear up somebody's name? Did you not know the Bible say whatsoever man sow, that shall he also reap? Get it if you think somebody didn't have good moral character in something they did at one point in their life, but you didn't either at one point. I'm sure some all of us done did wrong. So why in the world spend a whole 24 hours of your time that you would never, ever, ever get back 
to tear down your sister. Yeah, say la. Hmm. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Think about that. Why would you waste a whole 24 hours of your day turn your sister down? Father God, help us in the name of Jesus. Break every shackle off of us that we think that in order for me to get up, I need to tear you down. Nobody does this but us. And I know I got some white people on here probably talking about, girl, what did you talking about? Yeah. We be doing that to each other. I'm going to talk about that. I told y'all. Oh, I did. A, I did. But I, I, I said I was going to make a whole new video. But I'm going to talk about this. I made one when I was doing some earlier today and I deleted it because I said, no, listen, you just got to make that in a whole video. I am. Um, I've got a video going to be coming out. Maybe that might be Friday's. After this one, this one is Friday morning. Maybe this one might be Friday afternoon. I want to talk about us black people that be hurting each other in the workplace. Mm -hmm. Black on black crime in the workplace. Next video. Stay tuned. All right, y'all. I love you. Bye. Talk to you later. Now, I know this one was heavy. I told y'all sometime in the morning, going to always be nice. You know, that's why I took out that motivation. Because sometimes, some things... Don't feel like it's motivation, but it is. Mm -hmm. Y'all, uh -uh. catch me at 12 o'clock. We're going to talk about this black-on-black -black crime in the workplace.